We're at the Caravan and Motorhome Show at Manchester and have I got something to show you. It's the Eurotrekker 1 from Motortrek. Uh, for those not quite up to speed with uh, Motortrek, they're fairly new to motor caravans but are an established coach building business based in Huddersfield. They've been building accommodation and transporters for the equestrian and motorsport people for many years. They're a very well respected company. This is one of six colourways. This one's black, but they all have a fully colour coordinated cab and side graphics. Let's take a deco inside. Wow, just look at all this space. Even my portly figure can't fill all this. The secret is this slide out unit here. It moves in for travel and out when on site. Brilliant bit of engineering. Not very often I have to walk to a kitchen in a motor caravan, usually just turn around, but this really is so spacious. It's a great galley. It's got a three burner hob, stainless steel sink, combi oven and grill there, and hooray, a microwave at a sensible height. I think the interior finish to the cabinet work is bang on the money. Really tasteful, contemporary, but if you don't like it, there's another four finishes you can choose from, or you can have some lockers or doors in one finish and some in another. The choice is yours. Just when you thought you got rid of me, I'm back again. This door from the lounge area leads into the bedroom and it shuts off the shower on the left and the hand basin and toilet on the right, makes it ensuite to the bedroom. Uh, at the far rear, we have this end bedroom. Uh, it features a queen island bed that's uh, actually very spacious, I know because I've measured it. Uh, let me just double check. This is uh, four foot eight, that's wider than uh, a domestic bed. Uh, the advantages of a permanent bed are many, but in a nutshell, you don't have to convert uh, the lounge, so you can leave that as a lounge. You don't have to make the bed up every night, and you can choose a grade of mattress that's orthopedically correct. Those of you that are long-terming or full-timing will know you really need one of these. Uh, as befits uh, such a palatial motor caravan, there's lots of storage, high-level lockers, low-level, a fabulous one here. Just look at the quality of the mouldings around it. In fact, I've counted up, there are eight high-level lockers just in this area. You can see the amount of interest that this Euro Trekker one is generating, and rightly so too, in my opinion. Let's sum up, it's an awful lot of motor caravan for the money, it's got two slide outs, it's fabulously finished and it's British built. Bottom line, 65,995 for the 150 brake horsepower engine. I think it's fabulous and I'll leave you with this thought. That lounge is big enough to hold a county ball. This is really strictly come motor homing.